The murder trial and conviction of former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin captivated the world. And now what happened in the courtroom is the focus of a new course at Mitchell Hamlin School of Law. As Fox 9's Hannah Flood tells us, the case offers many learning opportunities for aspiring attorneys. In just over a month, former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin's case went from inside the courtroom at the Hennepin County Courthouse in Minneapolis to the classroom at Mitchell Hamlin School of Law in St. Paul. We're in our second week. We're going to talk about opening statements and the COVID restrictions on the trial. Former defense attorney John Radson and defense lawyer Rick Petrie stand at the front of their classroom, understanding what it's like to be on each side of a trial. He's doing what defense lawyers often do, which this is, is to, distort, to distort the record. No, 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 the record speaks for itself. While the world watched the Derek Chauvin trial happening back in Minneapolis in April, they realized how many learning opportunities could come from such a unique and public case. There's just an abundance of learning opportunities in one trial, um, coupled with it's right here in our backyard. Petrie said students were also eager to talk about it. The class was put together based in part on a demand from students. The law school allowed them to put together a hybrid in-person and online class this summer, examining the many challenges of this case. And thanks to cameras in the courtroom for the first time in Minnesota, students get a front row seat to what a high pressure trial really looks like. As folks who are interested in how the law works and as becoming practitioners, um, it really is just a unique, uh, incredibly valuable opportunity for us. By using clips from the trial, you will learn that on May 25th of 2020, Mr. Derek Chauvin betrayed this badge. Petrie, Radson, and their students, both online and in person, can have real conversations about how lawyers handled the many twists and turns of this complex case. Like you said, there needs to be, just pick a theme and right. go after it. From the courtroom to the classroom, this monumental and televised case is teaching a new generation of lawyers about one of the most contentious trials in recent American history. You just don't get those opportunities all the time because it, you don't have the material, first of all, to do it. In St. Paul, Hannah Flood, Fox 9.